Hi guys, welcome to back to my channel. This is prom look number five. Slightly more of a golden, bronzy toned eye, bronzy skin, very glowy, and also a red lip. So if you'd like to see how I've got this makeup look, then just keep watching. So first I'm taking the Kiko Infinity Eyeshadow in 204, which is like an orange toned shade, and this is going to be my transition shade for this eye makeup look. Then I'm taking this deeper brown shade just to deepen up the crease. This is number 235, again a Kiko Infinity eyeshadow. I'm going quite heavy with this shade as well and kind of popping it onto the lid as well. And then go back in with that orange shade just to help blend everything together. And then just repeat on the other eye. Then I'm taking this beautiful gold shade from Kiko. I think this is one of their wet eyeshadows. So you can you can have it wet, but I used it dry. I find these work best when you use your fingers. Then I take this more orangey gold shade to pop on the outer section of the eye. I thought the two blended really nicely together and created a really beautiful eye look. Then I went in with that brown shade I used earlier just to deepen up the very outer corners ever so slightly. Then I went in my collection Extreme Bold Eyeliner to create a winged liner. I just created a quite a thin winged liner. I don't want anything crazy. Then going to the skin quickly, I'm using my Makeup Revolution Face Primer. I focus this mainly on the inner section of the face because it is silicone and it's meant to be pore filling. Then I'm taking my Nip and Fab foundation and mixing some of the iconic original Illuminate in there to make for a really glowy base because this is kind of like a bronzy glowy look I was trying to go for. As you can see it has created a really nice glow to the skin which is perfect. Then going my MUA palette, concealer palette, and I'm taking which shade am I taking? This shade. <laughs> I'm using this to conceal under my eyes. Then going my collection press powder just to set that in place. Then I'm going back in with that brown shade from Kiko and using this along my lower lash line. I do smoke out quite a bit. Then taking that beautiful gold shade again and just popping this on the inner corners of the eyes just to help brighten them up. Then I'm going on the Ardell Demi Wispies as per usual and popping this on, popping them on my eyes, obviously. These are, I actually have to say, the Demi Wispies are a really nice pair of lashes. I find if you're not a lash wearer, wearer I think you would really like these because they're not really thin bands, they're not heavy on the eyes, and I just think they complement most eye shapes as well. I just think they're really pretty. Then I think I'm with my Kiko Sculpting Mascara just to coat my lashes. So a lot of Kiko on the eyes today, I realised. I'm also using it to help blend the false eyelashes into my natural lashes. Then I'm going with the Barry M Contour Stick. Now I find this is actually, once blended out, it's quite warm on my skin. So I kind of used it to bronze up my skin as well. And as you can see, I haven't set my skin yet because I am going with some powder. I'm uh, going with some cream products, but I will be powdering and setting later. So I do do a little bit of nose contouring, but ever so slightly because I'm very bad at nose contouring. Then going back in with those iconic 
Lumi Drops, not Lumi Drops, um, the, the Illuminator, and I'm using this to highlight my usual areas, so top of the cheekbones. I just find these sink in so beautifully to the skin and just create the perfect glowy skin. I also pop these a little bit down my nose, cupid's bow, and above the brow as well. So all my usual areas basically. And then going in with the powder, like I said, because I want to, although I want a really glowy base, I do want it to last a reasonable amount of time for the evening, so that's why I'm going and setting the entire face. But I waited till I did all the cream products first, then to add some extra bronze, I'm going with the I Love Makeup Summer of Love Triple Bake Bronzer. Then I'm going with my MUA bonbon blusher pop this on my cheeks and blending it into the contour and then for lips I'm using my matte me liquid lipstick from sleek this is the shade I don't know whatever the red one is called I think it's called party pink even though it's not pink um, but everything will be listed down below and I thought it's a really beautiful lip color for this eye combination eyes it makes a really good combination. I just think I love these bright red lips in general. Then I'm going with my Freedom Pro Fixing Mist to set everything in place. And then that completes this makeup look. So that's the last of my prom makeup look. So stay tuned for the hair and the, make the outfit videos. But I really hope you enjoyed the makeup looks I've created. And I will see you in tomorrow's video.